what, how do you feel about um, how do you feel about singing? Singing? Uh, yeah. I mean, you mean me or other well, people? Well, yes, your own or other people. I'm not but... crazy about other people. I like yeah. a few singers. <laughs> I like Tom Jones and I like uh, I like Jolson and Cantor sang well and and Perry Como when he was awake. And, uh, <laughs> sometimes people thought he was a corpse standing there. You know? it, it wasn't was really. Job. He was getting a lot of money and worked in the barber shop. But he was a nice fellow and sang beautifully. Anyhow, are you? Asking me to sing? Well, I was—I thought I might entice you because you have so many great songs. I love songs to sing, there. really. Say, I've had. Lydia is great. Lydia is great. But then I have to drop the cigar until I come back and keep your filthy hands off. <laughs> All right, I'm not used to this. Okay, tell them what it is. This is a song from a picture called uh, A Day at the Circus, which we did at MGM. Yeah. And uh, I sang this in a Pullman car. But... <laughs> now, why are you applauding a Pullman car? <laughs> there aren't any more Pullman cars. <laughs> anyway, we, in this picture, we had a gorilla. It wasn't actually a gorilla. It was a gorilla skin with a man inside of it. Sure. And, uh, he had a manager. This gorilla skin had a manager. <laughs> this is true. And we engaged him to bring the pelt over to the studio. Mm -hmm. And then we engaged a man to go inside of the gorilla skin. And he also had a manager. So we had two managers there for one gorilla. <laughs> and this, this skin was awfully hot, you know, with all the lights. And it was in the summer, we're doing this scene. And during, uh, during lunchtime, the fellow who was in the skin, he went over to the lunchroom and he got an ice pick and he bought about 40 holes in this uh, gorilla skin. And when he came back, he was very comfortable inside of this uh, skin. But the manager got wind of this, the manager of the skin. <laughs> and he was in a rage. And he says, well, we're not gonna permit this. And he says, give me my skin, get that guy out of there. And he threw the pelt over his shoulder and walked out of the studio. Now we had about three more scenes to do with the gorilla, but we had no skin. <laughs> so we had six people from MGM rushing around San Diego and all around that section of California looking for another monkey. <laughs> we needed a, another gorilla, but we couldn't get one. We got an orangutan, <laughs> which is only the, uh, half the size of a gorilla. Did right. you know that? I, no, but I do no. now, and I'm glad. And then we had to get a magic. <laughs> We had to get a midget to go in this, uh, in this orangutan skin. Yes, and then what? And then we got hundreds of letters <clears throat> when the picture come out from fans who said, we don't understand it. The gorilla was this high. And, <laughs> and it was only this high in the second half. And we never told them that we had had a, a, an orangutan with a midget in it. <laughs> Tattooed lady, she has eyes that men adore so, and a torso even more so. Lydia, oh Lydia, that encyclopedia, oh Lydia, the queen of tattoo. On her back is the Battle of Waterloo, beside it the wreck of the Hesperus too, and proudly above waves the red, white, and blue. You can learn a lot. From Lydia. When a robe is unfurled, she will show you the world. If you step up and tell her where, for a dime you can see Kankakee or Paris or Washington crossing the Delaware. <laughs> Lady, when her muscles start relaxing, up the hill comes Andrew Jackson. Lydia, oh Lydia, that encyclopedia, oh Lydia, the champ of them all. For to bet she will do a mosaica in jazz with a view of Niagara that nobody has. And on a clear day, you can 
see Alcatraz. You can learn a lot from Lydia. La, la, la. <laughs> Come along and see Buffalo Bill with his lasso. Just a little classic by Mendel Picasso. Here's Captain Exploring, exploring the Amazon. Here's Godiva, but with her pajamas on. Oh, Lydia, oh, Lydia, say, have you met Lydia? Oh, Lydia, the champ of them all. She once swept an admiral clear off his feet. The ship's on her hips made his heart skip a beat. And now the old boy's in command of the fleet. For he went and married Lydia. I said Lydia. He said Lydia. I said Lydia. Lydia. 